animals have two goals in life, surviving and reproducing. Therefore, actions that promote mating are pleasurable and reinforced by the reward systems. This is conserved in flies, where mating is naturally rewarding to males. And failures to mate increase the motivation to consume alcohol as an alternative reward. However, flies who do mate have high levels of a small peptide in their brain called neuropeptide F, which makes them indifferent to alcohol. But it wasn't clear which element in the mating process is rewarding. Is it courtship, the female's pheromones, sperm release? To test whether ejaculation is central to mating reward, we activated neurons that express the neuropeptide corazonin and promote ejaculation. First, we used a two-choice arena, where flies can choose between a red light zone that triggers optogenetic activation of corazon and neurons, or a dark zone. Flies immediately chose to be in the red light zone, implying that ejaculation induced by the activation of corazon and neurons is pleasurable. Next, we paired a specific scent with the activation of corazon and neurons. And another scent in the absence of activation. Once we gave the flies a choice between the two scents, they went towards the scent that reminded them of the experience when the red lights were on. Repeated stimulation of these neurons increases brain NPF levels and makes the flies indifferent to alcohol. This is a step towards understanding the interplay between natural and drug rewards, and mechanisms that underlie the risk of developing drug addiction. <laughs>